Today is Tuesday, by the way. A normal weekday here. So all the shops are open. Everything is uh, busy, lots of people. One thing I'm uh, looking for, it's why I'm kind of looking inside this uh, small hardware household goods shop, is something to boil water with, you know, to make coffee. My kettle is broken and it's been driving me crazy because I can't make coffee in my room right now. And uh, so I'm looking for either a small travel kettle or one of those elements you just put in your cup and then you can heat water. Let's see if they have one here. That shop had a, a couple of uh, like household kettles. They would be uh, too heavy to put in my backpack, I think. So, Funny thing, as always, is that the item I'm looking for is quite a specialized item. And it's not only hard to find, it's hard to describe. Like even in English, how would you describe that thing? You know, well, it's a electrical element that you plug in and you put in a cup to boil water for noodles or coffee, you know? But of course, I, if I can't do that in English, there's no way I'm going to do that in uh, Burmese. So all I can do is go into a shop and scan the walls and see if they have it. My guess is I won't be able to find it. It's not a big deal, just something I'm keeping my eyes open for. I found kind of a lightweight kettle and we're testing it to see whether it uh, turns on. Oh, light goes on. Okay. Good. Yes, sure. So, you are using it when you are troubled. In the hotel room. In the hotel room. Just to make coffee. Uh, why not? Uh, Already uh, you can have coffee in your hotel. I wake up very early and the restaurant not open yet. So. Okay, yeah, yeah. Like, Nowadays, young people like to sleep late. No, I, I wake up early. Yeah. So I like to have my own kettle. You made it late. chat. Okay. Only over two dollars. Yeah. Very cheap. No, it's a good price for me. Can you buy it at Canada at two dollars? No, 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 no. Impossible. Impossible. Yeah, impossible. Everything in Canada is so expensive. Expensive? Yeah. Really? Everything, yeah. Four thousand? So your first Thank you. visit to Myanmar? This is my second. Second. Yeah, second visit. Yeah. The last one when? You uh, only three or four months ago. So short time ago I was here. But I didn't do enough traveling. So this time I want to go to new places, you know, in Lay Lake and when other places. November and December. It's good weather for foreigners. Maybe. It's very hot. Yeah, I don't know. Is it in November cooler? Is it better temperature? Yeah. Yeah. November, December, January. Okay. Okay. It's the hottest. Hot. Thank you. October, quite hot. Okay. And April, the hottest. Uh huh. Uh. Last time I was here in a heat wave during <laughs> you know Thing Yan Festival, the water festival. Yeah, yeah. That's when I was here. Yeah. It was so hot. It was crazy. April, the yeah. hottest. Hottest. Man. So right now it feels okay to me. Yeah. So last time, how many days did you spend in my country? Uh, two months. Two months. Yeah, long time. So, Yangon, Bagan, Mandalay, that area. Yeah. Myanmar people are very willing to help. Yeah, we that help is people true. from the bottom of our heart. Thank you. Not so many. Thank you very much. I appreciate yeah, okay, it. Okay, nice to so meet you. Good you too. You enjoy your stay in my country. I will. Thanks for your help. As shopping experiences go, that was a very painless one. Dare I say, even a pleasant one. Yeah, the young girls in the uh, store spoke you know limited english they were quite brave you know they were very willing to uh, chat with me see what i wanted um yeah they weren't nervous dealing with me at all and i ended up buying one of those little kettles you know <laughs> yeah you have wallets and uh belts yeah i don't need one 
No, I don't need one. Thank you. No, bye, Vanas. It's okay. So, yeah, I bought one of these kettles. It's not as light as my previous one, which was made out of plastic. This is a metal one. Um, but it is very lightweight. And it is so inexpensive that you could buy one of these, use it for a couple of weeks in one city, and then just leave it behind. I paid 4,000 chat for it, which is yeah, two and a half dollars US, something like that. Um, <laughs> it has some crazy directions on the side. That's worth the money just to get the directions. I'll read a little bit of it. This produce is the best of the same types. Its heat is the cold contract tube. The cup's body adopt the super stainless steel. It is made of the cold contract heat tube. It possess efficiency of heat, save electricity, simple and artistic, uncorrupt and reliable. For two dollars, two and a half dollars, that is a deal. It has the merits of avoiding leak, good function, well organized, proper use. It is the perfect. I cannot wait to have my first cup of coffee with this little kettle. I'm very pleased with this purchase. How about a quick unboxing right in the middle of uh, Myanmar on a pedestrian overpass? Get it out of the way. There's the box. Forbid heat without wear. I'm not quite sure what that means. Stainless steel wear. It's an electronic cup. Yeah. <laughs> There's nothing to that lid at all. Is so thin. And there it is there. I don't think it has any kind of safety features. You know, there's no off on switch, like when it boils water, that it turns off automatically or anything. I'll find that out. And you have a little uh, handle and a screw down there. You attach the handle. And one thing I like is that it has this extremely lightweight cord. The cord feels pretty much like a uh, fire hazard. It, it's so light, it feels like a piece of string. So I don't even know if it can carry proper electricity to boil water. So who knows, this could be a disaster in the making, but we'll give it a try. <laughs> My electronic cup. They do have some small kettles here, two liters.
1.8 liters. This produce is the best of the same types. Its heat is the cold contract tube. The cup's body adopt the super stainless steel. It is made of the cold contract heat tube. It possess efficiency of heat, save electricity, simple and artistic, uncorrupt and reliable. It is the perfect.